Imagine stepping back in time, deep into the icy forests of ancient South America. You're not alone. Looming over you is a creature straight out of a fantasy epic. Myladon, Darwini, the giant, Grand Sloth. Forget the slow, cuddly sloths. You see today, this behemoth was a true titan. Is only dwarfing early humans and weighing over a ton. It was a walking, breathing fortress of fur and muscle. Picture this. A creature standing as tall as a small elephant, with a thick, shaggy coat, protecting it from the biting Patagonian winds. Its most formidable features were its limbs powerful, stocky legs to support its immense weight, and arms ending in claws that looked like they were forged from nature's own steel. These weren't just for defense. These side-like claws were perfect tools for tearing down branches, ripping bark off trees, and digging for nutritious roots. The Minodon was a master landscaper, an herbivorous powerhouse that literally shaped the world around it. For thousands of years, these giants roamed the land. Fossils, including remarkably well-preserved skin with bony plates embedded within it, tell us they were tough customers. They weren't just passive grazers. They were an integral part of the ecosystem, their feeding habits creating clearings in the dense forests, which in turn allowed new plants to grow and supported other species. They were a keystone species, a true pillar of their environment. So what happened to these magnificent beasts? They vanished around 10,000 years ago, likely due to a combination of climate change and the arrival of skilled human hunters. Their story is a powerful reminder of the incredible life that once walked our planet and the delicate balance that sustains it. Thanks so much for journeying back in time with me. If you enjoyed this glimpse into the prehistoric world, please hit that like button. Subscribe for more amazing stories, and ring the bell so you never miss an update. See you in the next one.